Samud Avli, Mar Brachot, Perk Shishi Daf Lamad Chet Bet, Chapter 6, page 38b. And we're just going to start from the last few words on the previous page. Bish Lama Ia Mar Hamotzi, it would have been well if he had said Hamotzi, another chapter of 38b. Ashmi Ashminan. Tamav Ashminan de Hilchata Karabanan. He would have taught us the meaning and he would have taught us that the law is in accordance with the rabbis. Ela de Mamotzi, but that with when but when he says Motzi, Maika Mashmalan, what is he teaching us? But you Davad and he did La Apuke Nafshe Mip Mipl uh sorry Mip Lugta. He did remove himself from the dispute. The Hilchata Motzi Lechem in Haaretz, and the law is a Motzi Lechem in Haaretz. The Kaima Lanka Rabbanan, for we hold in accordance with the rabbis, the Amrei Dafik Mashma, who say that Hamotzi is uh, is for the one who has brought forth. Ba'al here, Katamir Bechule, and on vegetables, what do you say? You say, uh, Bori Pri Hanama. Katamir Katumia Defat, the Mishnah states vegetables similar to bread. Ma Pat Shinishtana Ayade Haor, Haur, just as bread was transformed through fire. Ah, here a cot nami shnishdanu al yadei ha'ur, so to vegetables that were transformed through fire, meaning cooked vegetables. Ah, ma rabbanai mishmei da'abaye, rabbanai said in the name of abaye, zot omer shlakot mevachim alehem bori priyadama. This says, on cooked vegetables we recite bori priyadama. We'll skip the bracketed area. Darash, Rav Chiz, Darav Chiz, who announced Mishum Rabbeinu in the name of our teacher, Umanu Rav, and who was this? It was Rav. Shlako Mevachin, Alehem Borei Priyadama, on cooked vegetables, we recite Borei Priyadama, Rabotenu Hayordin Me'eretz Israel, and our teachers who come down from the land of Israel, Umanu, Umanu, Ula, Mishmei de Rabbi Yochanan Amar, and who is this? Ula. Sorry, Umanu, and who is this? Ula, Mishmei de Rabbi Yochanan. Ula, said in the name of Rabbi Yochanan. Shlakor mevachin alehem shakol niyebidvaro. On cooked vegetables, we recite shakol niyebidvaro. Vani Omer, <coughs> I say, Kol she tichlato bare priyadama. Any whose initial state, that is when eaten raw, is bare priyadama, Shalako shakol niye bigaro, and when cooks it, you now say shakol niye bigaro. The kol shetichlato shakol niye bigaro, and any vegetable whose initial state is shakol niye bigaro, shaloko bore pri adama. When one cooks it, you say bore pri ha adama. That means that when you cook it, and it makes something that is edible, thus this is the uh, ultimate use of the of the item that was that was um, that was uh, picked. Bishlama kol shetich latosh shakol niyebidvar shlakov arepriyarama. All is well. Any whose initial state is shakol niyebidvaro, if one cooks it and it becomes uh, and then you be, and then you come to use the bracha bore priyadama mashkachat lach mashkachat la bi bich rava besilka bekara you find it such as cabbage and beets and pumpkins which obviously you need to have cooked and not eat raw ela koshitikla to bore priyadama shla kosha kol but any whose initial state is bore priyadama, and one cooks it, uh, and that everything, and so the blessing is shakoni bidvaro. 
Hey, chi, mashkachat la. How do you find this? I mean, which vegetables are eaten raw? Am Arav Nachman Bar Yitzchak, Rav Nachman Bar Yitzchak said, Mashkachat la betumei vechate. You find it in garlic and leek, which uh, are often eaten raw. Darash, Rav Nachman, Rav Nachman announced, Mishum Rabbeinu, uh, in the name of our teacher, Umanu Shmuel, and who is this? Shmuel. Shlakot mevachim alehim bore pri harama. On cooked vegetables, we recite bore pri harama. Vechavereinu hayotim me Eretz Yisrael. And our colleagues who come down from, from Eretz Yisrael, Umanu, and who is this? Ula, Mishme de Rabbi Yochanan ama. Ula, he said in the name of Rabbi Yochanan. Shlakot mevachin alehem shakol niye bidvaro. On cooked vegetables, we say, shakol niye bidvaro. Vani omer vemachla loket shnuya. And I say, it is a matter of Tanaic dispute. That is that the two rulings are at odds with one another in regard to cooked vegetables. Detanya, for it was certain of Raisa. Yo Timbaraki Hasharui Hasharui we can fulfill with a wafer that was soaked uh, in water. Uh, so that is we can fulfill matzah on Pesach. Ovim Uvushal Shalo Nimoach or with one that was cooked that did not dissolve. <coughs> Divre Rabbi Meir, these are the words of Rabbi Meir. The Rabbi Yossi on there, but Rabbi Yossi says, Yotzin Baraki Kasharui, we can fulfill with a wafer that was soaked in water. Aval lo bimevushal af al pi shelonimuach, but not with one that was cooked, even if it did not dissolve. Velohi, <coughs> but this is not correct. For all agree, that is even Rabbi Yossi, that cooked vegetables, we recite the, the bracha, Borei Priyadama, but Ad Kan Lo Kama Rabbi Yossi Hatam, and that's what Rabbi Yossi has not said there, Ela Mishum Devinan Ta'am Matzavaleka, more than, uh, more than, that because we require the taste of matzah and it is not and it is not uh, we can't have matzah if it's cooked aval hacha but here about cooked vegetables afilu rabbi yossi moder even rabbi yossi agrees i'm just going to scroll down So we are at where um we're about two thirds of the way down the page. <coughs> Rabbi Yossi Modeh at the beginning of the line where it's about to start Amar Rabbi Chia Amar Rabbi Chia Bar Abba Amar Rabbi Yochanan Rabbi Chia Bar Abba said in the name of Rabbi Yochanan Shlakot mevachin alehem bore priyadama on cooked vegetables we recite for bore priyadama the Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yefet Amar Rabbi Yochanan but Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yefet said in the name of Rabbi Yochanan Shlakot mevachin Alehem shakoni bidvaro. On cooked vegetables, we recite shakoni bidvaro. Ama Rav Nachman Bar Yitzchak. Rav Nachman Bar Yitzchak said, Kava ula leshabeshte leshabeshte karavi binyamin bar yefet ula. Ingrained his mistake in accordance with Rebi Binyamin Bar Yefet, with the mistake of saying Shakoni Bifarov. 
Rabbi Tahe Bar Rabbi Zera. Rabbi Zera thought about this. Vechi Ma'inyan Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yechet Etzel Rabbi. Rabbi Chia Bar Abba. Why? What was the comparison? What comparison is there between Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yechet and Rabbi Chia Bar Abba? Rabbi Chia Bar Abba Dayek Vegamir Shamatav Mer Rabbi Yochanan Rabbi. Rabbi Chia Bar Abba is precisely memorizing a teaching from Rabbi Yochanan, his teacher. The Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yechet Lo Dayek. Whereas Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yechet is not precise. The odd. Rabbi Chia Bar Abba called Tlachin Yomin Mehader Tamudei Kamei de Rabbi Yochanan Rabbe. And furthermore, every 30 days, Rabbi Chia Bar Abba would review his learning before Rabbi Yochanan, his teacher. The Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yefet Lo Mehader, whereas Rabbi Binyamin Bar Yefet did not review like this. The odd Bar Min Dein or Bar Min Dein, and furthermore, aside from this and aside from that, sorry, aside from this and aside from this, Dehahu Turmasa de Shalke Shalke de Shalke Le Sheva Zminin, sorry, Zimnin Vakadera for this Turmut, so a Turmasa, it's a kind of bean which they cook seven times in a pot. And they eat it as a dessert. They came and asked Rabbi Yochanan, which bracha to say. And he said to them, We recite Borei Priyadama. And furthermore, Rabbi Chia Bar Abba said, Ani ra'it yet Rabbi Yochanan she'achal zait maliach. I saw Rabbi Yochanan eat a salted olive. Uvarecha lav t'chila v'asof. And he recited a blessing on it at the beginning and at the end. Hi amart bishlama shlakot bimiltayehu kayme. This is fine if you say that cooked vegetables remain in their original status. That is Bore Priyadama. But chila mevarecha lav Bore Priyadama ha. At the beginning, though, he would recite Borei Priya Eds. Oh, this is, sorry, the olive is a Borei Priya Eds. Uvasov mevarecha lav mebracha achad me'en shalosh. And at the end, he would recite on it the, uh, the, three, bre- the three blessings. Ela i amat shlakos lav v'mil tayehu kaime. But if you say cooked vegetables do not remain in their status, as the original vegetable. It is fine. At the beginning, he would recite him a blessing that everything came into being through his word. But at the end, what blessing would he recite? Perhaps he would say, uh, at the end. Mativ Rabbi Yitzchak Bar Shmuel, Rabbi Yitzchak Bar Shmuel raised an objection from this. Yerakotcha dam yote bahen yedechov atov pesach, the vegetables with which one can fulfill his obligation on Pesach, uh, that is eating maror. Yote bahen uve uva kelach shelahen, one can fulfill with them, or with their stalks, that is the leaves or the stalks. Aval lo kevushim velo shlukim velo mevushalim, but not pickled or stewed or cooked. Ve'isal ka datach b'mil tayehu kaye. Now, if it should enter your mind that cooked vegetables remain in their in their original status, shlukim amai lo. Why not fulfil with stewed or cooked maror? Shani hatam devinan ta amarov veleka. It is different there. For we require the taste. <coughs> we require the taste of maror, and it is not, and there is no taste if it's pickled, stewed, or cooked. Amale Rabbi Yirmiyah le Rabbi Zera, Rabbi Yirmiyah said to Rabbi Zera, Rabbi Yochanan hechi mevarech al zait maliach. How did Rabbi Yochanan recite a blessing on a salted olive after eating it? I'll just finish to the next, the beginning of the next page. Kevan dishkila 
legarine. Once the pit is taken away, basale shiura. It has less than the amount required for. So it has less than the amount than the amount that is the amount required for a, an, a, saying the blessing afterwards.